What is up guys, Expert Winner here, but you can call me Dominic, and we are back here with WWE 2K20 Michael Emo. We're here in part 2 for Winterfest. Let's do this. That was awesome! It was everything I've ever dreamed of. <laughs> I'm numb with excitement, or maybe I'm just frozen, but either way, I get to cross two things off our list. And you did it without emotionally scarring any children. <laughs> Wrestle <laughs> first match, and win first match. Nice of your mate to help you out there tonight. Maybe if I see you again, I'll have some backup too. I look forward to it. By the way, I didn't really mean any of the things I said out there. Especially about you having the personality of a koala. You're way more pleasant, and I'm actually a big fan of your people's blooming onions. You're a total bogan. Wait, is that a good thing? I don't think so. Congrats I don't even know what that means, and I'm an Australian. <laughs> I, you let me down. And I don't think I'm true Australia. What do you mean? It's been a last minute change of plans. My surprise opponent for tonight was injured. Is that who I think it is? That's right. Oh, it's Prince me, Pretty. The King of Cuteville, Prince Pretty. <laughs> Unfortunately, I slipped on some ice and stubbed my turning toe. Your turning toe? Yes, the most important toe. EI, the toe one uses to turn on a runway. Ugh, I can't stand non models. Anyway, it's a shame all these uggos here tonight will no longer get to see me compete against Riley Flash. Not that it would have been much of a contest. I mean, look at this man. I have let myself go. He couldn't lace my boots on his best day. To be fair, some of my finer boots are slip-ons that don't have any laces, but you get the point. Anyway, Trey, I need you to take Tyler's place against me. Okay, cool. I, I thought you said I wasn't ready. You're not, but I liked what I saw from you out there during Red's match, and also I don't have any other options. All right, I'll do it. First match. Do you want a picture to commemorate this moment? That'd be great. <laughs> um, we're not that high, Tyler. I'll post it for you. Hashtag, mmm, gorgeous. Are you sure it's just, just not gonna be you? You know? <laughs> uh, let's move on. Ah, uh, we don't have to move far. So, we have, um... We can talk to Tyler Breeze or we can talk to Tyler Breeze. You know what? I choose to talk with Tyler Breeze. Let's talk to him. You know about fashion. Obviously. Go on. Well, I already went out there once tonight, so I want a different look for my match against Riley Flash. Do you have any last minute suggestions? Ah, the classic quick change, as we models call it. Well, when I look at you, I see three options that fit the theme and location of this show. Oh, we got Lumberjack, Prince Pretty, or Speed Skater. Let's do Prince Pretty. Who wore it better? I'm kidding. We all know I did. Good luck, Prince Not So Pretty. <laughs> I get a stealthy stick, alright. But obviously I'm gonna take a selfie if I have a stealthy say, come on. Okay, now we can go to the ring or let's go to the ring. Let's not play around, let's head to the ring. Oh please tell me we've got this entrance on. I wanna see him come out as Oh tell me I'm coming out as Tyler Breeze. That would be nice. Alright, let's go see. Wow, that's an interesting look. You don't like it? It's fine. It's just that maybe you should worry about the actual match, you know? I know you don't like to hear it when it comes from Riley, but he has a point. You might be too focused on everything other than what happens inside the ring. People remember cool entrances and costumes. Entertainment is what makes wrestling great. Wrestling makes wrestling great. Well, there's more than one way to thread a needle. 
Actually, there's only one opening on a needle, so... Whatever, you know what I mean. Anyway, what's more important is you're going to have your first match. So have a great one. And entrance, too. Thanks. Okay, let's do this. Don't tell me I've got to sit through another loading screen. Yep. Let's see our entrance. Alright, let's see our entrance. Oh. I would have wished that we would have came out with a stealthy stick at least. That's my regular entrance, but we're just in Tyler Breeze's outfit. No, it's flipped. Alright, let's get to the match. Dang it. Okay, let's see his entrance. Okay. Let's move on. Let's play the match. You probably can't hear the entrances. I don't know why. Alright, let's go. Get Riley Flash to yellow health. Let's do this. Okay. I like how the uh, commentator, uh, commentator was uh, shocked at uh, Alzerian uh, Riley Flash. Nice cutter. Okay. I like how the commentary is like, oh, so this is how why Riley Flash um paid the big bucks to, for the surprise entrance. It's not me actually. Was going to wrestle him. He just got um his surprise opponent just got injured. Right, got him to yellow health. What's now? Uh perform a strike while Riley Flash is near the bottom barrier. Is it this way? Oh, just in case you're upset that uh, Riley Flash was Zeus and Trey. Okay, there you go. That's it. What the hell? <laughs> He's tongue stuck. <laughs> what the hell's. <laughs> What the hell? Look at Riley Flash, he's like, what? Well, right, yeah, Riley Flash to Red Health. Boom, beautiful cutter. Alright. Alright, missed the insecurity, look back. Don't top you're not gonna help oh. what strength by Trey Considering this is Trey's first huh. match, it doesn't look as bad. I mean, <laughs> so you don't like my outfit, down. Okay, what are you doing? Oh beautiful Elbow drop straight to the chest. Riley Flash hasn't got anything going for him. Besides some reversals. Atomic drop. Irish whip. Oh. Elbows. Hit up side the face. As I said, Riley Flash hasn't done anything. He just beats my up. He beats me up. Oh, reversal. Oh. I like how the um, 
Yeah, this guy's funny. Oh, yeah, you know. Okay. Come on, reverse. There we go. Red health. Ow. Reform my pin while in the ring. Okay, do I just do a normal pin? Dang it. Alright, neck breaker. Go for a pin. Yep. One, two. Kick out. Uh. What are you doing? It was only a two count. There was easily a two drop. Two count. Oh, punched. One, two, three. So you lost to a punch. Are you kidding me? Because you thought a two count was a three count. I. This guy's hopeless. Hey, I want to thank everyone for coming out to the show. And also, it needs to be said that I had two students who had their very first matches tonight. Not like Red, the commentary uh, termentary came out. Yeah. Isn't that incredible? And now Trey, who had a good effort on short notice, but got a little bit ahead of himself. We'll work on his counting. Trey, I'd let you have the mic, but I think you might be a bit tongue-tied. <laughs> Give it up one more time for Trey. All right. There's Winterfest done and dusted. Uh, let's move on. I was thinking of ending it, but I want to see what happens in this cutscene. Ah, see you after the cutscene. <laughs> what a night! I'm thinking Pavones to celebrate. Isn't that place super expensive? It's on me. Well, technically my parents, but we deserve it. <laughs> All right, I'm in. Now get that heat blasting. That's weird. The gas is full. I'll, I'll call them back later. Well, maybe they can help with the car. And we can tell them about our first matches. No. Hey, it's Red. You're on speaker. Oh, hi there. Are you visiting Denver at college? What? Uh, now's not really a good time. Why? Is something wrong? Or are you having car trouble? Yeah, we are. How'd, how'd you know that? Just hang up. Cut the crap. We remotely disabled the SUV because we know you're not at school. And we're pretty sure you never were. We got an alert about a substantial charge in Canada for something called Riley Flash's Wrestling Academy. And then after we looked into it, we discovered charges for the past few months, including a crazy hotel bill, gas, food, clothes, you name it. Do you know how disappointed I was when I realized I was going to have to return all those reward points? I was this close to a free trip. This close! It is not about the stupid points. We were hoping you'd come clean on your own about all of this, but I guess you're just gonna keep on lying. Hey, wait. Look, this is what I want to do with my life, and no matter how many times I told you that, you still didn't support me. So I was pretty much forced to lie. Would you rather I be miserable at school? Of course not, but you have to be realistic. You are never going to make it as a pro wrestler. There's a better chance of me dating a supermodel. Frank! Which is impossible because your mom is stunning, and I would never date anyone else. I will make it, and when I do, you'll wish you would have had my back before I was successful and famous. It's not too late to try to put all this behind us. We'll activate the SUV if you come home now. Then I can try to get you re-enrolled in school for next semester. You're gonna have to ship the car home, because I'm staying here to pursue my dreams. Maybe someday you'll understand that. Oh, wow. Well. Hey, Ben found out. What are you doing? You're gonna get yourself killed. I'd rather that happen than talk to you right now. Leave me alone. Sorry, but I'm not going anywhere. We set out to do this together, and this doesn't change anything. I mean, other than the fact we now don't have a car or somewhere to sleep, but you know what I mean. I still want to do this if you do. I appreciate your loyalty, but you lied to your parents and me about what we were doing here. And you basically sat back and let me steal from them. Don't worry about the money. I'll pay them back. And I'm sorry, but you've always told me to take the advice from my birth parents' letter, right? About following my dreams. 
Well, that's all I was trying to do. You didn't need to lie to do that. It's the only way I could see this working. But I'll never keep a secret from you again, I promise. From now on, it's total honesty between the two of us, okay? You're gonna know everything, even how many times a month I shave my toes. You shave your toes? <laughs> what? See? I'm an open book. Okay. So, no more secrets, okay? I know he said no more secrets. But you can't tell him ours. It will ruin him. Wait, what? No, no, wait, okay. wait, hold up, what? No more secrets. So now what do we do? We're carless and without the credit card. Pretty soon we'll be homeless. I think our only option is to hit the road and try to make some money on the indies. But we'll have to start roughing it like actual up-and-coming wrestlers. You think we have enough cash for a new car? I wouldn't say new. Hold up. What was there? What's the secret she's holding behind us? I guess we'll have to find out. We managed to get a used car that fell under our budget, probably because it also fell under various recalls and safety violations. Do we stick our phones in this slot? Nothing's happening. I think that's a tape deck. This car doesn't exactly have the latest features. Roughing it, remember? Right. So I'm assuming there's no Bluetooth. No, but I did find an actual tooth in the trunk. Shark or human? Human, I think. Lame. Well, <laughs> what? now that we have our extremely safe and luxurious ride that may or may not have had a body in the trunk at some point, where to? We do have Wrestle in Memphis on the list. Assuming this piece of junk can make it that far, then I guess we're headed to the great state of South Carolina. That is where Memphis is, right? Close. Maybe I should drive. It's fine. I got this. Oh, what the hell? Is that also a feature on older cars? Nope. Don't think so. Did he break the car already? Okay. Okay, well that's... Cool. Okay, that's gonna be the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you wanna see some more WWE 2K20 my career mode, let me know down below. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.